Good afternoon, everyone. Senator Eric Berthel coming to you from outside of the Senate chamber at your state capitol on Wednesday, January 30th. We are about one month into the uh, first, uh, first part of the new legislative session. And a lot of issues that you've been writing my office on and calling on uh, are of troubling concern to me as well, specifically the uh, idea of regionalizing our, uh, our schools. I'm a firm believer that um, our schools should be controlled locally by our local government with local control and local leadership. And I will uh, work to first understand a little bit more about what this bill would mean. Uh, but what I've learned so far is that this is not a good practice for, uh, for the state of Connecticut. Uh, we need less government, not more government. I'm also very troubled, as are you, by uh, the idea of three specific tax increases that have been floated in the last week or two. Uh, one of those being an increase in the Connecticut state sales tax to 6.85%, which would be a half a percent increase. Uh, I will fight very strongly against any tax increase, specifically a tax increase on, uh, on sales tax. And there's also been some discussion in that sales tax increase in expanding the things that we, uh, we tax, including things like uh, groceries and prescription drugs. The second tax that you should also be concerned about and you have written about is a 1% tax or one mill tax on real estate that would be collected by the state of Connecticut and the proceeds of which would be distributed not back to our towns but uh, to places where the state of Connecticut believes there's the biggest need. I think this is inherently unfair. Our towns today base their mill rates and base what we collect in taxes based upon the specific needs of the town that is collecting that tax. And I think that that system, whether or not we like paying those taxes, that system is how we properly fund the needs of every municipality in the state of Connecticut. And lastly is a uh, proposal to create a 19 mill statewide car tax. And again, this goes to what I just spoke to. Our towns set their mill rate based upon what the needs are to run the government of that town and provide all the services, municipal and educational. And this is an opportunity for our tax dollars to be spent outside of our towns and in a way that we ultimately have no control over. And I will be fighting against all of those. So thank you for being here. Thank you for listening. Thank you for writing and calling the office. Please continue to follow what I'm doing on your behalf as your voice, as your state senator in the 32nd via my website at senatorberthel.com. And I will be back to you soon with additional updates throughout the session. Thank you.